Step 1. Obtain your router information. Before starting the setup of your brother printer, you need to find and write down some very important information related to your wireless settings of your router. George will help you find that information. 1. SSID. 2. Network Security Settings. Let's find the name of your network called SSID, also known as the Service Set Identity. Click on Start. Click on Connect To. A window will open with a list of available networks. Scroll through the wireless network connections. Please write down the information of the network that says Connected. This is your SSID. Close the window. Let's find your network security settings. Since you already have set up your router, you should have your security settings. Forgot or lost the info? Consult your router documentation before going further. You now have all the necessary information to start setting up your brother machine. Step 2. Activate the wireless card of your brother printer. Press Go four times. This will print the network configuration page. The first line of the page will indicate the status, and it should read Brother NC XXXXXW IEEE 802.11 B over G active. If the wireless card is not active, it must be reset to become active. To reset the wireless card, do the following. At the back of the printer, above the network connection, there is a small hole. Insert the tip of a pen in the hole and hold for 5 seconds. Release. The toner light will flash. Turn off the printer and turn it back on. Press Go four times. This will print the network configuration page. The text on the top right side of the page should now be node type brother nc xx xxxw ieee 802.11 b over g active. Step 3. Establish a wireless connection between your brother printer and PC. Click on Start. Click on Connect To. A window will open with a list of available networks. Scroll through the wireless network connections. Select Setup. Click Connect. Click Connect Anyway. Close the window. Step 4. Establish a connection between your brother printer and your PC using the installation CD. George will show you how to do that. Insert the CD-ROM of your brother printer into the CD-ROM drive of your PC. Select your model. Select your language. Select Install Printer Driver according to your geographic region. Select Wireless Network Users. Select Wireless Setup Only. Click Next. Select Step-by-Step -step Install, Recommended. Click Next. Select Without Cable, Advanced. Click Next. On the Next page, check the Checked and Confirmed box. Click Next. At the Changing the Computer's Wireless Settings window, click Next. On the next page, check the Checked and Confirmed box. Click Next. At the Available Wireless Devices screen, choose the Brother printer you wish to set up. Click Next. At the Available Wireless Network screen, select the Wireless Network name, SSID, you wrote down earlier, and click Next. At the Authentication Method and Encryption mode, enter the security information of your network and click Next. At the Wireless Network Settings Confirmation window, check the Print Test Page After Submitting Settings box. Click Next. On the next page, check the Checked and Confirmed box and click Finish. Step 5. 
Establish a wireless connection between your PC and your original network. Click on Start. Click on Connect To. A window will open with a list of available networks. Scroll through the wireless network connections and select the wireless network that you wrote down earlier and click Connect. Enter your network security information, then click Connect. Close the window. Step 6. Set up the driver of your brother printer. From your taskbar, click on the Macromedia Player tab. Select Install Printer Driver according to your geographic region. Click on Wireless Network Users. Select Driver Install Only and click Next. At the License Agreement screen, read it and click Yes. Select Standard Installation and click Next. Select the recommended option and click Next. Select your brother printer model from a list of discovered devices. Check the Set by Node Name and click Next. Check the Set as Default Printer and click Finish. At the Installation Completed window, select Yes, I want to restart my computer now. Click OK. Your driver is now successfully installed. You should now be able to print wirelessly. Thank you for your support, George.